time machine has killed them. 1846 will be a new track record for that journey. Box now for the running of the first. Just about all in the set. Best of British on the inside, Alunga beside it, so stand by for a dispatch. They're ready to go now. Away they go. Best of British got out uh, quickly. Now running about a little bit, we find his uh, time machine, but it's going all right. Then uh, follows Little Boots. It's uh, running second, and then uh, Cool Nitro kicking up on the inside. Time machine getting to the front now from uh, Cool Nitro. And uh, further back, the others, but it's got a nice break, and Time Machine goes to the line and beats Misty Scene, who flew home. Exclusive bells run third, best of British. Then our longer further back was Cool Nitro, and last in was Little Boots. In. Ready. And racing now, Time Machine jumped fairly. It's going to lead, I think, the favourite. Yes, it will in the run to the first turn from Camtown Sheik, showing pace. Getting through along the inside next was Canari, making ground also. In fact, now to get the second was Title Patch. Around the outside, getting the third, Shavers. This leader's race, 10 in front. In fourth spot now, Canari. Further back in the field, then Ebert's son. Behind it next, then we had Camtown Sheik from Mr Merlin and Zoo Crew. Time Machine, a flying machine. It's eight in front. Will it shorten stride? In second position was Title Patch. Further back, Shavers. The leader, Time Machine. They're not going to pick it up. Up, and Time Machine gets home by four. Total patch second, third home Seamus. Next to finish was Ebert's son, further back Cunari. In behind those next then we had Camtan Sheik from Zoo Crew and Mr Merlin. Now Time Machine exploded from the boxes. It's going to head off Cindy Loper in the run of the first turn and lead clearly. It's out in front, Time Machine by three or four to Cindy Loper. Getting to third then as they work towards the back now was Scarlet Satin from Rover Stride. Well back in the field, then a further two away was Count Catrock from Blue Pursuit. Second last Panhandle and last of all War Perella. But this is a flying machine, Time Machine, but will it keep going? It's six or seven in front, cutting it down now as they come towards the turn with Scarlet Satin clear of Cindy Loper. Time Machine in front, it's got too big a break, getting very tired. It gets him by a length and a half. Second, Scarlet Satin. Third, home, Cindy Loper. Next to finish, Blue Pursuit. A nice run. Put that in the black book. Further back in the field, Pan Handle with Count Catrock. Getting tied back towards the rear of the field. War Perella on there with it. Rover's stride. Tricky Chariot from the inside jump fairly. Snoop again began very quickly though. He'll lead Time Machine. Then Tricky Chariot flying through Aussie Elegance. Admiral Hawk next. Further back Thanadian and last of all was Bandstand. But Snoop again led by three. Time Machine second. Further back Tricky Chariot. A good gap then to Aussie Elegance. But in front Snoop again to the outside. Time Machine. Time Machine coming at Snoop again. He got up. Oh good run that. Time Machine got up to beat Snoop again on his merits. Third home in the event Tricky Chariot. Further back flying true. Next to finish was Bandstand from Thanadian. And oh no, he's been a naughty boy again, I think, Admiral Hawk. Aussie Elegance with him at the tail. Wayne Racing now, she jumped only fairly, winning the start time machine. He's going very quickly, looks like leading tonight. From Mai Tai Gil, and Skona, Joe Ashley, Anita, then Lady Katandra. Further back in the field, then Lonesome Star from Carfire, then Cathroy Fly, last of all, but about to turn for home. Time Machine flying four in front of Ashley Anita, then Lady Katandra, but it's all Time Machine. He wins by five to Ashley Anita. Lady Katandra third, then Mai Tai Gil, Ashley Anita. Further back, and Skona, Joe. Next to finish in the event, Lonesome Star from Carfire, then Cathroy Flyer. 1897. Set. Racing now. Winning the start with Snoop again. He's going to lead Time Machine early, then Bilby. Further back, Special Park Phantom Flyer. Well back early, then Magic Tongue, Ashley Anita, and Catch a Cap. Snoop again by two. Will Time Machine run him down again? They're clear of Bilby and Special Park about to turn. Snoop again in front, but here's Time Machine laying it down on the outside. Time Machine races to the front. He's too good, Time Machine. By two to Snoop again. Bilby third. Then Special Park Phantom Flyer, Ashley Anita, Catch a Cap. And one of the last in, Magic Tongue. <clears throat> Pardon me, they're already race number eight. Away they go, Brother Bill on the inside began fairly well, City's Crystal showing plenty of early speed, now Time Machine's beaten for early pace, out wide Special Park and they were followed further back in the field there by Blue Chief with Tempo Queen and also Phantom Flyer Janok Drive around the home turn however and getting up on the inside, Brother Bill the leader but here's Time Machine, cuts him down close to home and Time Machine wins again Brother Bill's run second, Special Park third with City's Crystal fourth they're followed by Phantom Flyer, further back was Blue Chief, next to last would be Tempo Queen and Absolute Janok Drive. Dog War, Time Machine and Lefebvre Boy will soon find out. 
Racing, Time Machine began quickly. Lefevre Boy missed it. He's back near last and Time Machine leads early. Getting up along the inside, Special Kate runs to second from Gannett Fly. Then Scythea making ground City's Crystal. Well back, Lefevre Boy. Second last, Tivoli Flyer. Last, Cunari, but he's flying, Time Machine. Oh, he's much too good. He's raced away from Gannett Flyer and City's Crystal. And Time Machine by about seven. Now, City's Crystal's run second. Third home in the event, Gannett Flyer. Close up then we had Special Kate. Lefevre Boy made ground late. Scythea was in that bunch. And further back then to Cunari, which was one of the last in with Tivoli Flyer. Five cents and 50, 275 and 85 from number one, Collis Kid. They're away and racing. Now, Time Machine began fairly well. Yes, it rails up on the inside for a few strides. It was headed by Scythea, but now Dash is clear by two or more lengths to Scythea. They're followed by Total Recall going up on the outside. Back on the inside, Collis Kid. Further back was Supreme Pledge and Aladdin's Boy. But he's a mile too good, Time Machine. Strides right away. Total Recall's done a nice job to run second. Scythea's finished third. Fourth in was Collis Kid, they were followed by Aladdin's boy. Further back, Supreme Pledge, a good way back, Canary, and last in Tempo Queen. Favourite time machine looking for 12 straight. Wayne Racing, Aussie Elegance began fairly well. Uh, now Time Machine's mustering speed quickly on the outside and driving through to Snoop again as Time Machine goes to the front on the first corner. Snoop again was second, Aussie Elegance was third, followed by City's Crystal. And further back in the field then Knight Supreme, but around the corner it's 12 straight Time Machine. He's blitzed them again. Snoop again's run second, Aussie Elegance was third. Close up Colonel Scott, the jumper, a nice run fourth. They're followed in by City's Crystal. Next home was Monteith Patch, second last Magic Tang, and last in Night Supreme. Racing, Time Machine jumped away fairly. Snoop again's going to lead in though. Aussie Elegance gets the third in fourth spot. Then Tandra's Glow back on the inside. Panty pedal. Back in the field. One was badly checked. That was Charming Tom, but coming to the turn. Snoop again by a length. Trying hard Time Machine there. A clear of Tandra's Glow on the outside. Time Machine the inside. Snoop again. 14. What a great effort. Time Machine by a head. Snoop again second. Tandra's Glow third. Then Panty Pedal. Aussie Elegance. Further back in the field. What a show. Lady Catandra and Charming Tom. Great run. 326 the journey. Favourite from the yellow. They're set. Racing. Time Machine. Box well tonight. A pretty good dispatch. Snoop again trying to head him off. Snoop again and Time Machine to the first turn. Clear of Pandora's King Lively Nation. They're followed further back in the field then by Storm Chariot out wide. Well back in the field. Aussie Elegance catch a cab. But Snoop again in front. Time Machine trying hard. Snoop again in front. Time Machine's got him. Time Machine too good from Snoop again. Storm Chariot's got up the third from Pandora's King Lively Nation. They're followed home then by City's Crystal. Uh, well back Aussie Elegance and catch a cab. And racing now, and Time Machine began quickly. He's going to lead tonight from in second spot on the outside, Mako Bay, making ground snoop again with Lady Katandra, Charming Tom. Well back in the field then was Pandora's King, Lady Lander, and also well back was Storm Chariot, but turning for home, he's raced right away. Time Machine's a mile in front. Mako Bay holding down second, and then Lady Katandra, and Time Machine easily. Mako Bay second, Lady Katandra third, fourth home, Charming Tom, then Pandora's King. Next to finish was Storm Chariot, and further back in the field then to Lady Lander and Snoop again. 19.03 the time. 26 metres is set. Racing. Away well, beautiful glow. Time Machine and Jump. The Rattler both going quickly. The two favourites go together. Clear of City's Crystal. Further back then to Cool Ace Royal Chimes. And well out of it, Johnny's duo. But Jump the Rattler got clear on the turn from Time Machine. Trying hard then. Beautiful glow. Further back, Cool Ace. Time Machine coming and Jump the Rattler. Time Machine got up. Time Machine and a great go, got up to beat Jump the Rattler. Beautiful Glows run third and they're followed by Extra Murph Cool Ace. Royal Chimes well back from Johnny's duo and City's Crystal one of the last in. Go, first of ten on the card here at Gawler tonight. Not too bad an evening. Racing Time Machine box pretty well on the inside. Johnny's Dolly away okay out wide. A Condor Magic was there early. Railing up all Regal further back. City's Crystal. All one down on the track was Ashanti Silver Machini Star. Well back with it. Sid Shadow drove through to about third or fourth. But it's Time Machine well clear from Johnny's Dolly. Then all Regal. But it's all Time Machine. Too good. Johnny's Dolly second. Third placing goes to all Regal. Then Sid Shadow further back in the field then would have been Condor Magic City's Crystal. A good gap Machini Star. It was one that was in trouble off the back and the one that got went down a shanty silver is up and has chased the field home our machine racing 
Ed Fox fairly Time Machine away pretty well towards the inside Bilby but Time Machine heads off Bilby they're clear then of Bally Hennessy further back special Park Seamus getting through on the inside would have been Miss Ranchy and uh, back there humble words but on the turn it's all Time Machine and it will win easily Time Machine wins four or five second placing Bally Hennessy Bilby for third then humble words there on the inside would have been Miss Ranchy uh, festival which never really a hope and the last couple special Park Seamus. Racing time machine box pretty well. Tricky Chariot will be a couple of lengths behind it. Magic Tang was away well. Down on the inside, all regal. Tricky Chariot in trouble out wider. Bilby checked out of it there. Cool A special park well back with Sarah Girl, but it's old time machine. It's going to win in a breeze. Tricky Chariot's running on with Magic Tang, but time machine scores. Magic Tang hangs on for second from Tricky Chariot. Then all regal, clear of Cool Ace. Further back in the field, then two Bilby. Sarah Girl special park the last cup. Odds on now on the TAB was set to go. It's drawn out in seven time machine. They're ready. Racing it jumped pretty well. Lady Katandra out well on the inside. But Time Machine goes for the early lead. Third charming Tom from End again. They are followed by Kentucky Star. Got into trouble. Oh, there's trouble up front. Time Machine and Lady Katandra both got into bother. Charming Tom in front. Time Machine coming again there. Well clear of Magic Tang. Time Machine gets up. Time Machine gets up and beats Charming Tom. Magic Tang was next in. I think that's Magpie made there and they're followed by End again. Lady Katandra, Sid Shadow of time machine and they're all set lights on coming from the red time machine 65 cents on the tab off they go time machine came out quickly is going to be the early leader up there on the outside pinaroo googly also there around the turn bilby from brother bill uh, followed further back then by high street well back then in fact and again in front of those on the turn time machine the leader and again trying hard from bilby but it's time machine in front it'll win by two or three and again bilby's got third from high street they were clear then of brother bill pinaroo googly further back and always well back magic tang and all regal Set to go, here's the lure, 326, the John Hempson stake. Set. Off they go. Time Machine away well. Slow out. Minkara Gold. Luck now. No speed. Brother Bill or Flying uh, True and Gazela's Gem. And going to the lead. Time Machine by a length and a half to end again. Badly checked was Luck now. Racing third. Minkara Gold. Then Brother Bill from Sid Shadow. Well back on the inside. Gazela's Gem. But around the turn. And Time Machine powering. And Time Machine ran wide going. That fast wins by three. Minkara Gold has flashed home and got second. And again was two lengths away. Third followed by Brother Bill. Then came Flying True from Gazela's Gem. Sid Shadow last of all was Luck now. 18.70 the time. Pace to burn, Time Machine. Number four, Time Machine, the winner. 1895 and number six, Time Machine, just keeps on winning. 14 in a row. A white and blue dog by Chariot Supreme out of bonus offer, whelped in December of 85. Owned by C&J King. It boxed fairly, but quickly mustered speed. And by the time they got to the first turn, it was about three in front. And by the time they'd headed into the back it was about eight in front and said catch me if you can and they couldn't number five time machine the winner three two eight time machine the 326 meter king and he's really uh, well he's uh, for once and for all perhaps put that uh, down now with the new record